So today guys, I bring you yet another incredible XP farm. And again guys, another crammed spot full of enemies which in turn gives you lots of great loot, quick XP and everything you need. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and I'm giving away a copy of the Ultimate Edition version of Diablo 4. To be with a chance of winning it, simply drop a like on this video, make sure you are subbed and leave a comment down below. Good luck. Okay, so this dungeon is unreal. The amount of enemies that are in this small certain area is beyond crazy. Now I don't want to say this might actually get nerfed but with the amount of elites and normal enemies here and the amount of XP you can get from this pretty pretty easily, well a nerf may eventually come. So use this while you can. So this dungeon is called the Haunted Refuge and it's located right here on the map. Now we'll say this can be done solo but the best way to farm this dungeon for that quick and efficient XP is to do it in a team of at least two. Because to progress the dungeon, you need to locate two pedestal stone carvings to open up a door so you can actually progress on. So in a team of two, I recommend running past all of the enemies and grabbing one of these stone carvings each. Now they will be obviously in separate areas, so obviously split off then meet at the door to progress. Now if you do see any events down here before this door, I would recommend you grouping back up and doing these as they're quite easy and it's decent XP and can also get some great loot from these too. Now you will see elites along the way before opening that first door, which again, I run past just to make this farm more efficient under XP, but if you want to kill them, do as you please. So once you open a door guys, there's normally a small event that you have to progress. So get this out of the way. Now from here guys, you need to run forward, avoiding all of the enemies and make your way to that large group you will see on your mini map. You cannot miss them. Normally right by them, there's a shrine event or even a shrine you can use. But the shrine events, the cursed shrine events, uh, these you want to activate because they spawn in way, way more enemies. Now the instance you're seeing on screen now guys, doesn't actually have a shrine event here, but you can see the amount of ads here right now is unbelievable. But hey, if that shrine event ain't here guys, there's still, there's still an absolute ton of enemies here, massive amounts of elites and tons and tons of XP for you to gain. There's also guys no boss within this dungeon, so after you've killed these guys, there should be another smaller group of enemies that you need to take out and an elite will spawn too, but most of the time guys, he joins in on the fight with this other larger bunch of adds. So yes people, come here in a team or solo. Team wise, you can get this farm down literally to three to five minutes. A solo, I was doing it earlier, around seven to 10 minutes. If your build's strong enough, even quicker. I'm not gonna lie though, mine at the time of finding this wasn't quite up for the job, but I could still clear them out in, like I said, seven to 10 minutes. So yeah, not too bad whatsoever. Now remember, to farm, if you are in a party, simply run the dungeon. Then as the party host, you need to leave that party from the in-game menu. This will teleport you, the host, outside of the dungeon. You then simply reinvite your team back to your party, rinse and repeat the dungeon people. Now as a solo player, you need to clear out the dungeon, then you need to leave the dungeon first, either by bringing up uh, your map and leave the dungeon this way, or pressing up on your d-pad and leaving the dungeon this way. Now once you're outside of the dungeon, you want to leave your game via your menu. Then rejoin back into your game. This also resets those dungeons and those enemies within them, so you can just farm, farm, farm away. But there we have it guys, another amazing XP and loot farm you don't want to miss, which I would suggest you using while you can. Guys, on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.